wouldn't it be nice if it was really simple for mental health and addiction recovery for it to just be like before and after this is before this is after this was me the way i used to be and this is the way that i am now my name is seth i'm in bipolar recovery and i'm in recovery from addiction i'm a pastor and I'm going to tell you a little bit about before and after. Wouldn't it be nice if it was just one prayer, one time I went to church, someone prayed with me, and that was my before and after experience. Wouldn't that be nice? Wouldn't it be nice if it was just one church service? That's right. You heard me right. Going to one church service where I heard the voice of God. Wouldn't it be nice if it was just one blessing? That's right. You heard me right. One blessing from a priest or someone with spiritual credentials, like a shaman or something, and just one time, one one blessing that's all it took and that was my before and my after experience wouldn't that be nice wouldn't it be nice if it was just one 12 step group one time I found them and they were the answer and that was my before and my after experience but you know what it didn't happen that way it happened a different way and wouldn't it be nice if it was just one sponsor from that 12 step group that showed me the way that taught me and that was it and that was my before and my after experience wouldn't that be nice and wouldn't it have been nice that on my first celebration of my sober date year one that that was all that it took that that was the before and the after experience that I needed and it stuck right after that and I didn't have to do any other work wouldn't that be nice and wouldn't it be nice that the very first time that I ever shared my story openly at a drug and alcohol treatment center to other clients that that was it that was the before and the after experience that I needed. Wouldn't it have been nice that after the very first time I wrote my first blog article that that was the hurdle that my recovery needed? That from then on out, it was before and after. And wouldn't it have been nice that after I made my very first video right here on this channel, that then that was the before and the after experience that I needed. And then from then on, I was just an expert, an actual expert, and I could call myself recovered. And wouldn't it have been nice that at my very first speaking engagement, where I spoke about mental health and addiction recovery, that that was the time that I graduated on. It was my before and after experience. But what ended up happening was something greater sure I think there is no before or after there's no beginning or ending for my mental health and addiction recovery all I can say is it's a continuum and it's a wonderful journey to be on so if you like what you heard today watch more of the videos that are on this channel they're up on the screen right now